this is Ramen Squad. I'm Mama Ramen. Today I'm gonna do my one of my favorite anime movies of all, Princess Mononoke Sam. Do you like her? I love her. She, you know, that she's the warrior. She's really strong, and then she is absolutely beautiful. And then, you know, actually, you know, um, in my life, I'd never drawn anything from Ghibli movie because I respect them too much. I was just too scared to, like, you know, make a drawing out of those characters. But anyway, today I'm going to try my best. So, how you know, let's see how it goes. So, this face... Um, <clears throat> So she's looking at this way and then we can see left side of her face more than the right. Can you see like in you know, the 40% here, 60% here. So I'm going to divide this into 40% and 60% here. Yeah? <coughs> and then the, so the eyes is really like, you know, angry. That's the scene where she's seen Ashitaka for the first time. She hates human, so she's like, you know, you know, don't look at me, just go type of, you know, really, really fierce eyes. So this one. Yeah, so something like this, and that, uh, and then, yeah, eyelashes. I didn't know some had eyelashes. It's nice doing, by, um, you know, by doing the drawing of my, you know, favorite characters, I get to observe each character, you know, much more than I did before. I'm discovering so much about her at the moment, her, you know, facial feature. Right, and then the nose is coming around here, I think, and it's a continuous from the eyebrow. So I'm gonna f first of all mention the eyebrow first, and the another eyebrow here, there, and then the yeah, the nose going like that. So I want to ask you everyone, what is your favorite character from the Studio Ghibli? All of it, like all the different, you know, um, movies. Which one is your, you know, most favorite character of all? It would be really difficult. You know, my one. Oh my God, it's really difficult. Um, you know, I love, of course, you know, Sam. I love Sam. But also, I love cat bus so much, neko bus. If you actually seen, you know, my neighbor Totoro, I'm sure you fell in love with um, the, um, the neko bus, the cat bus, and you actually wants to ride, you know, inside the neko bus because it's really soft, it's really, really, really comfy. And it moves, and then the, do you remember that you know, you know he opens up the door, which is his like you know side belly, and you can go in. Gosh, it's so nice. So yeah, think about your favorite Ghibli character, and then maybe you can try doing that you know drawing of that character. Actually, do you know what's the most you know like you know um e easy one to choose? I reckon that is um. Uh, Kodama. Do you know Kodama from Princess Mononoke? That, that little one goes. That one. <laughs> okay. Okay, she's got quite a big gear. Um, and of course. A really really big accessory here and then the, the other accessory over here and then the ear here 
and Up. And I'm gonna mention her neck so I can continue working on the the hair at the back. Yeah, something like that, yep. And then That's it. Oh, I love her look. She's ever so, like, you know, fierce, gorgeous, um, like, you know, warrior. And at this point, he believes, uh, she believes she's part of the, um, like, you know, God War family. So she, she doesn't know she's actually a human. And then the another accessory here, and then another accessory here. That's it. Okay, and then finally, so that's you know, even though this part you know, um, hides her shoulder. You kind of imagine and then continue the line and you can continue the line like that. Yeah, so I think that's it. And then continue, continue, continue and then going like that. Yes! So, her makeup, the tribe makeup. Beautiful. I think that's it. Yes. Woohoo. I'm so excited. Seriously, this is the first time ever I'm drawing any character from Studio Ghibli in my life. And I'm so glad I chose my favorite girl, Sam. Yeah, as I told you before, find the objects or things that is in front first, most in front. So for example, this um, the accessory, the head accessory is coming on top of the hair. So just some, you know, finalizing where it is, you know, you're not going to make mistakes of um, like, you know, going over it. But, you know, even if you make that, you know, I don't call it mistake, sorry, because, you know, you have to like enjoy, so don't worry about that. And you know that you you can practice many many times. That's the fun bit. And you know what? Often when you do the second time, you remember the lines. You really remember your like you know, hands remembers where you know you put the lines, and then that is you know like you know guiding you where to do so you're improving a lot but also you enjoy like you know rediscovering all the um lines you've done before okay so
こなきゃ。The accessory I'm doing the ink in a little bit here and there because I know this is in a block. When I notice those first, maybe sometimes I do it along the way. That's it. So all the lines done here. Now going to yeah the eyebrow and here. And then I'm telling you all the time, I think maybe you know I don't need to remind you because that is something I tell you know in the video all the time. Um, you know, the eyelid is you know most of all, most of the times thicker than the other part. So make the um out you know um eyelid lines thicker. Okay, and then the eyes. And eyes, and I think it is total darkness. I'm gonna do it total darkness. Don't forget another accessory. Right. And then this time I'm gonna use red. Do you know why? Oops, actually I'm gonna do oops. I'm gonna do like erasing all the pencil lines first. Because I remember ink other than black actually any colors on top of the pencil lines the pencil line will stay there forever if it's black you know it doesn't really show but if it's you know, like red like this color it shows so I decided to take out all the pencil lines first Okay, and I'm gonna mention 
you know, probably I shouldn't mention around her mouth that blood because it might be a bit too, um, you know, shocking for some of the um, people, you know, watching this, you know, maybe the little, you know, children. So I'm going to just mention tiny bit, but not too much. Yeah. That's it. Okay. So. Uh, first of all, I have to find a part which I can make into the darkness. Uh, I forgot to include this part. So first of all, here. And what else? Yeah, I'm gonna make this headband dark as well by the way you can move your you know like paper or the white card or whatever you're working on so it's easier for you to ink or color or anything like that I always do that for my job hair is pretty much all dark well, like you know the greenish color but this part is definitely darker than the rest so I'm gonna make it like this kind of you know um, quite dark hatching You know, in Japan, I was born in a really countryside, a uh, prefecture called Fukuoka. And then, um, you know, uh, from my house to the, um, you know, forest is one minute. And then from my house to, um, you know, the, the beautiful river is 30 seconds. So um, I believed when I watched, you know, Princess Mononoke, that actually, those guys are actually living inside this forest you know it could be one so i was imagining the possibility of meeting kodama and then the rest of the you know characters here so this part is much lighter than this part as you can see to make the contrast so the sunlight is coming from this direction you know Okay, Ooh, this is a big part, a lot of hatching. I'm gonna do a tiny bit of um, shading here. And maybe I can do a tiny bit line like that and line like that. And what else I can do? So oh, yeah, here. So this part is dark. Okay, now move on to. Oh, where's my? Oh, Uniball eye. So I'm gonna do a smaller shading here and there.
and here here and here and here Oh yeah, like that. So lots of shady part, actually. And this part is some, um, oops. I didn't mention this. And actually, some part can be quite dark. I'm gonna add a bit more detail into her eyes with this smaller pen and what else can I do is that almost all yeah I think this is everything just in case I'm gonna make some lines a bit stronger I think I'm done. So yeah. So this is sum. Actually, I don't know the spell of sum. In English, it's S A N S A N Mononoke. Sum. Yes. Okay. S A N. Okay. So S A N. Princess of Mo 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 Ke Ramen Squad Great So ta da Okay wait Whoop Ta da So this is my Princess Mononoke Sam I hope you enjoyed watching this and then um, you know um the today there was a lockdown in the uk it means you know we're gonna stay here for um definitely for the next three weeks so that means what you can do is you know practice drawing and then you're getting you know better and better at the every day so at the end of this whole lockdown you're gonna be the manga master yep okay thank you so much for watching see you soon Bye bye